Hi, welcome to this week's weekly vlog. Today is Monday the 5th of October. It's currently coming up to half 11 now. Leo is napping and Alice has gone out to the shops with Lawrence. Lawrence is working a late shift today, so he is working 2 till 10 or until they finish. Usually when he does a close, he doesn't get home to around 11, half 11. So, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do today. I've got nothing planned for the do with the kids today and yeah i don't know what i'm gonna do we'll see probably just play with the toys and stuff today so it's probably not gonna be a lot to film today um lawrence isn't off till thursday so yeah i'm not sure what i'm gonna do maybe tomorrow i might go out to the shop local shops with the kids not too far and i get some halloween stuff i might do that tomorrow maybe um today yeah don't know what i'm gonna do so um I've just filmed a haul video, a Disney haul video while they've been out because, and he's been asleep because the only time I get to do them. So I've managed to film that. I'm actually almost up to date now with editing all those sorts of videos. They're all scheduled to go up. I think I've got a video almost every day in October going up. So yeah, look out for them. There's one that's every day. I think a lot of people are doing Vlogtober where they put a video up every day. So I thought, well, I've got enough. I might as well do it. Although I've not announced that I'm doing it, I'm just going to put one up every day when I've got one. So yeah, I've got all those almost edited. Just need to edit the one that I've just filmed now. And then I'm up to date with those, I think. I've got one Come Shop With Me video to do as well. And yeah, that's the plan for today. I know I'm behind with the actual vlogs. I think I'm like four behind. And the next one that I have to edit, which is from the 14th, is the one where we went to Blackpool and Liverpool so I don't know if I'm going to split that into three videos because it's a lot of footage so we'll have to see what I do with that one I might just do day in the life videos for the when I go to Liverpool and Blackpool and do the rest in a weekly vlog so yeah I'll have to see when I get around to editing that which probably start doing that tonight so yeah at least I'm getting caught up now with all the videos because I've had videos that I've filmed ages ago and hadn't edited I do actually still have two craft videos that I need to finish editing. Um, I also have some videos that I filmed almost two years ago now which I don't think I'll put up which is annoying because it took me ages to film them as well. They were routine videos when Leo was like three months old. I don't know if I just put them up as old videos just in case someone wants to watch them. I don't know. We'll see but then they're still not fully edited because I need to do voiceover on them. I just never get a chance so I think I might just scrap them which is which is annoying because it did take a long time but never mind. Anyway I'm going to get on to some editing while they are out and then when Alice gets back we're going to make some lunch and yeah I'll go back to you later. Hi today is Tuesday the 6th of October it's actually four o'clock now I'm sorry I didn't film much yesterday and I'm probably not going to film much today either um we've just not been doing anything but today I'm about to make the dinner I'm gonna make paella today now I never usually make this Lawrence does it so we'll see how it goes. Plus I'm starting later than I should be. I should have started about half an hour ago making this. So we'll see what time it's actually finished. And so yeah, I've got everything prepared, ready, and I'm about to start cooking it. So I thought I'd do a little time lapse of me making the dinner. So I've got all the ingredients prepared. So I've got the chicken all cut up, the chorizo, celery, onions, and peppers. So it's all ready to go. I just literally have to cook it all. So I'm gonna get started now. Okay, so I've just added a bit of oil to the pan and then I've just added the chicken. So I'm just going to cook the chicken, then I'm going to add the chorizo. So that is the first step. Okay, so I've cooked the chicken now, so I'm just add the chorizo, cook that for about five minutes, and then I'll add all the veg in. Okay, so that's been cooking for about five minutes now. So now I'm just going to add all of the vegetables in, so peppers. The celery. And then the onions. Okay, so this has been cooking for about five minutes now, so I'm just going to add the boil water. I think that's about, that's about enough. So now I'm just going to add some tomato puree, then I'm going to add the rice. Okay, so I've now added the tomato puree in the rice, and now I'm just going to add some chicken stock to it. 
through it and then I'm going to leave it to simmer for about an hour. Okay, so everything is in there now, the rice, the veg, the meat, the chicken stock and the tomato puree and now I'm just going to leave it on there to simmer for about an hour, so maybe an hour and a half until it goes thick and nice. So I'm going to go and play with the children for a little bit now till dinner's ready. Okay, so it's now five o'clock, the dinner is all ready, so I'm going to dish it out, let it cool down a bit for the kids and then put the spare in the fridge so we can eat it tomorrow, so yeah. I'm really looking forward to this, it looks nice and yummy. Okay, so here's our dinners all placed out. This is mine, Leo's and Alice's. They've probably got far too much on their plate, but if they don't want it, they'll leave it. And then this is what's left over for Lawrence's dinner tonight and dinner tomorrow. So yeah, we're gonna go and eat up now because I think the kids are hungry. Hi, so it is now half eight. Alice and Leah are both fast asleep in bed. I don't think I mentioned before, but Lawrence is on a late today, so he won't be home until about 11 o'clock. So yeah, I've got a bit of time to myself now to get some stuff done. However, Leo usually wakes up after about two hours of being asleep and he fell asleep around half seven. So I've probably got about an hour till he wakes up again. So I think I'm just gonna do a bit of editing and maybe do a bit of sewing after that. So yeah, I'll probably get back to you a little later. So I've just started editing the vlog from the 14th of September that week and I've over got over four hours worth of footage for that week. So I think it's going to take me a while to edit this video. I think I might have to split it up. Um, we did two day trips that week. We went to Liverpool and we went to Blackpool. So I'm thinking I might just do day in the life vlogs for those two and just put like a tiny montage in the vlog weekly vlog. So I think that's what I'm going to have to do. I'm going to see, I'm going to edit it all, see how long it is and then see where I can split it up. So yeah, just a word of warning, <laughs> that week might be a long vlog. However, this is going to go up way after that vlog goes up anyway. So you'll, you'll know if it was a long vlog or not and what I did with it. But yeah, that's a lot, lot of footage. So yeah, I'm going to go back and start editing. Leo's still asleep and it is... 20 past 10 and what time do you go to bed half seven so you, i wouldn't expect him to wake up at half nine but this is looking good maybe he'll sleep through the night who knows anyway i'll get back to you later hi today's wednesday the 7th of october it is about quarter to three at the minute lawrence is on a late again tonight so he's just headed off to work a bit ago so it's just me and the kids now I stayed up last night really late editing uh, one of the weekly vlogs, a really long one uh, that was when we went to Liverpool and that and then this morning I stupidly overwrote the file and have lost the whole thing and I literally stayed up for, I literally stayed up till 4am doing it so that was a complete waste of my time because I've deleted it now so I need to re-edit that today which I'm really annoyed at. Um, but I did save the Blackpool and Liverpool bit, so they are going to go up as day in the life vlogs, I think. Uh, she's going to jail, I better go and check her. I'll get back to you in a bit. Hi, today is Thursday the 8th of October. It is half ten now. We are just getting ready to go out. We're going to go to the Trafford Centre today. And we're also going to go to Coppicewood Farm again for lunch, because we like going there. It's really nice. And yeah, that is going to be our day today. So I'm going to look around the shop, see all the new Halloween and Christmas stuff they've got in. I think a lot of the shops got their Christmas ranges in now, so it'll be nice to see that. And yeah, we're just going to have a nice day out today. So I will get back to you probably once we are on our way. So we are at the Trafford Centre now, we're just in the lift going up. We haven't really got time to look around the Trafford Centre at the minute. We have to go straight to the restaurant. We have to come back and look around in a little bit.
so we are at the restaurant now. I've just ordered on the app. Lawrence to take the kids to play in the play area for a little bit while we wait for the food. So it should be, usually come and ask them what you want on the carvery because you don't go get up yourself. Now they play to up for you. At least that's what happened last time, so we'll see. And yeah, so we both ordered the carvery today, me and Lawrence. Kids getting what they always get, chicken nuggets and chips, because they like that and eat it. And yeah, we probably will get dessert later. We actually had a voucher for £10 off when you spend 30 so it came to £30.15, so that's not bad. So I'm going to enjoy a nice lunch and then we'll go back to the shops because we had a quick look in the Disney store. They had so much new stuff. I think someone's coming now, let's go back to you in a minute. Here is the menu. It's the main menu and then they've got the dessert menu. But you have all your menus on the app, so we didn't really need these ones. So our starter has arrived. We always get the garlic bread with cheese as a starter. So we all share this. And we've got our carvery receipts. We just wait for someone to come and tell us when we can go up and get it. And then we've got the receipts for their kids' free ice cream. They get free ice cream with their dinner. So Leo and Alice's dinners are here. There's Leo's. I think, yeah, I think he has the peas. That's Alice's with the carrots. So they're just coming back from the play area now. I'm going to cut it up um, for them. So we're all tucking in. Well, our, me and Lawrence are just going to have our starter, then we're going to go get our carvery. But, oh, well, he's built a bit. And there's Alice's dinner. Yeah, Boulder. And he is tucking in. He was hungry, wasn't you? He's tucking into his. Give yeah, good dinner. boy. So this is my carvery. I just went for turkey, mashed potatoes and veg. This is Lawrence. He's already devoured most of his, but he went for, he went for all three meats. So he got turkey, gammon and beef. So yeah, I'm going to enjoy this now. So Alice has got her ice cream because she ate most of her dinner, didn't you? So she's going to eat that while we finish ours. I've only just started mine. <laughs> oh, we've seen her ice cream. <laughs> at the restaurant now it's really nice we actually got out there earlier than usual because they brought our dinner pretty quick so i think it's like half one now so we're gonna look in primark then we're gonna go out there and hopefully we'll look in boots because we've got all our christmas range out now so we're gonna look in primark and i'll show you what we've got
I'm just finished up in Asda. I'm just gonna have a quick look in Boots and then I think we're gonna head home. So yeah, go see what Christmas stuff they've got out. So we're just back from the shop. We bought a few bits. We bought some Halloween bits for the kids. And we also bought quite a few clothes for Alice this time. Usually it's Leah, but we've, Alex, we've seen that Alice actually needs a few new things because some of her clothes are a bit small. So, yeah, got those. I will take them out and I'll give you a quick look, but I will do a haul video, a proper haul video for the Halloween stuff and for the clothes. So I'll just give you a quick sneak peek at what we got. Leo, some new pyjamas. I've got Alice's cute little thumper dress. Got this little jumper. Nice little skirt. Got this cute little dress. So these are all from Asda. I thought this dress was so cute. This little Disney dress. £7 from Asda. 
got a little t-shirt that says world's best sister a little cardigan and then a picture of a free pack of leggings and then for Leo got him this little Disney dundarees which I thought was really cute so we also picked up these little wooden train things these were two pounds each and they've got a little wooden track that this fits on and they're just magnetic and join together so I picked that up for them they've already been fighting over it and then we've also got some Halloween stuff so I'll just quickly show you what we got so these are like Halloween bits we picked up so we picked them both up a little bucket got them both a little cup each picked up some baking bits to do with them for Halloween got some tablecloths I'm also going to hang one up as decoration these two cute little decorations hang up because I thought they were cute some napkins and plates a little door hanging and some balloons that's everything we got from the shops today so I think I forgot to show you what I picked up from Primark so I got myself this new Christmas phone case well my phone that's £3.50 it's got Leo some Lion King vest Pick Leo up this Marvel t-shirt and some Batman pyjamas and that's all the things we picked up from Primark Hi, today is a Friday. I am just about to head into town and do a bit of shopping while well, Lauren stays here and looks after the children so I'm off out on my own today so hopefully I'll be able to see everything I want to look at. I want to go in Disney Store, Primark, I want to see if I can look at some boots in Evans and yeah, just have a look around so I'll probably get back to you now once I'm in town. Okay, so I'm just in Primark now, just looking around the Disney section. I've already found a few things I want to buy. A little basket. Yeah, I'm just going to look around here and then I'm going to go to Disney store and see what they've got in there. So I'm just in the kids section and Primark. Just looking for clothes for Alice. She needs some jeans and some dresses and stuff. So I'm just going to have a quick look to see what they've got. So basically all the jeans that I actually like. They've not got her size, which is so annoying. I only have her size in pink and green and I wanted the denim one so let's go up around the other side oh, they've got some there so I've just finished in Primark now I'm just gonna go to Disney store have a look around there we've got all the new Christmas stuff and then I think I'll go home.
I thought I'd quickly show you what I bought from the shops. So I picked myself up some boots. Now I've got three pairs, but I'll probably be taking one or two pairs back just because I couldn't work out the sizing in the shops because you had to try them on with pop socks, which are really thin. And so the size six felt a bit big, but these felt not too tight, just a little bit tight. But then I thought if I've got socks on, these might be really tight. So I thought I'd buy them and take them back because these two pairs are in the sale they've been reduced from 42 pounds down to 10 pounds so i didn't want to not buy them go back and then not have them so i just bought them and i'm going to take them back whichever ones i'm i got a feeling these are going the cheap ones are going to be too small and i'm going to have to keep the 40 pound ones <laughs> although i wish my feet would fit into these ones but i'm pretty sure once i've got socks on these are going to be too tight so I need to try them on at some point with socks and see what they're like. I uh, picked Alice up some tights from Primark. Picked her up a pair of jeans and a pair of jeggings. Then for me, I picked up some Disney pins. These are the new pins that they've got. I actually picked up two of each because I'm going to keep one as pins. And then I like to try and make jewellery out of the other set. I always buy two to make jewellery out of the other set. And then I bought myself a new hoodie. This was £10. And just some ears when I film a Disney video. And I was hoping Alice might wear them, but she just keeps taking them off. So, yeah, that's everything I got from the shops today. Hi, so it's now half six. We're just getting the bath ready for the kids. Give them a nice bath. And then once they're in bed, I am going to try and do a bit of editing. Maybe some of few videos. Because I bought some stuff. I think I showed it to you. Um, some sort of Halloween stuff. That I want to film a Halloween haul for and I've also got some clothes that I bought for Alice the other day that I want to film a haul for so yeah I've got a couple of haul videos to film so hopefully once they're in bed I can do that we'll see, we'll see what happens yeah they're gonna have a bath and get back to you after so the kids are out of the bath now we're just getting them ready for bed Leo's all done and Lawrence is just changing the bed sheets, so they've got nice fresh bed sheets to get into. Now they've all been back. Oh, broke. Oh, yeah, you have broke it. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we're going to take them downstairs in a minute, give them their milk, and hopefully they'll go straight to sleep. What do you think, Lawrence? <laughs> we can hope, can't we? We can hope. Hey, this little man actually had his afternoon nap today because he started trying not to have his afternoon naps. So he might not go to bed yet. We'll see. Oh, what's Alice found? Yeah, they're what Mummy took out of the wardrobe because Leo doesn't need that anymore. He's too big. Do you want to play with them? So yeah, I'll probably get back to you now once the kids are fast asleep. Let's go downstairs and tell the old bed Alice putting her bears to bed. You're, You're putting your bears to bed. You don't need a dummy yet. <laughs> we'll get one when we go downstairs, okay? Mama, oh. downstairs. We'll go get I'm it. Too sure. Are all your now. bears gone sleep now, Liz? You enjoy your hair still. Night night bears. Hi, today is Saturday. It is I think it's twelve o'clock now. Uh, Leo is taking his nap. Lawrence had just nipped to the tip with my dad to take some things so we can try and get rid of some stuff before Christmas and the kids get all the new toys and take some stuff to the tip to make some space. Um, Alice is playing nicely with her toys and I thought I'd just quickly show you what I picked up from the shops this morning. I just went to the local shops and picked up a few Halloween bits for the children so I thought I'd just show you that and show you what we got. Okay, so I picked Alice and Leo up both up a costume each. These are both just six ninety nine from the shop. So I got her this little ghost one. She's just beautiful. I just thought it was really cute. I was going to get her the pumpkin one, but didn't have her size. So I thought they could both have been pumpkins because I got this for Leo. And Alice actually really liked this one, so I think she would have liked to be a pumpkin as well. But she might fit into this, so maybe they can swap costumes. So yeah, I got that one for Leo and that was $6.99 as well. And then to put in their little Halloween bucket things that I'm going to give him, I just got them these. These were 60 pence. They're just squidgy things if you um, bash them. They light up. So I thought that was cute. And 
So I'm going to get Leo the pumpkin one because he's a pumpkin and Alice is a ghost so she's got the ghost. And then I got them little lollies to match so she's got the ghost one. He's got a pumpkin, I think they were 60p as well. Got them both just some little chocolates to go in there. Baskets. Now this one seems a lot more. So maybe I'll give Leo the smaller ones and Alice can have these bigger ones. I've got some goo head chocolates, although I think me and Lawrence will probably keep them. And I thought these were chocolate bars, but they're actually chocolate lollies. So I split them between them into their little things. And then just got this because I thought it was really cute because we're going to have like a little party, just the four of us. So they have a fun day. And then it's got this to blow up, just a Halloween balloon thing. I've got Leo a little monster book and i got Alice a little monster colouring book. And that's everything. I got from the shops. Are you ready, Alice? One, two, bubble! <laughs> Do you want some more? <laughs> He's stomping them all. You ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Do you get them all? Where's the bubbles gone? More bubbles. One, two, three. Bubbles! Yeah. Hi, today is Sunday the 11th of October. It's half seven now. Alice and Leah are just having their breakfast. She's watching Night Garden. <laughs> more Night Garden. Yeah, more Night Garden. <laughs> so we're just having breakfast. Lawrence is at work this morning. He's working at a six till five shift today. So he won't be home until about half five, six o'clock. So I am going to try and make a roast dinner for when he gets home. So that's the plan for today. I'm going to make a roast. Also, for lunch, me and Alice are going to make some pizzas. Yeah, because she loves making pizzas and I like eating them. So we're going to do that as a little activity for her at lunchtime. Yeah. And that is the plan for today. Not got much else planned. I'm going to do a bit of editing. And that is about it. So I'll film what I can. There's probably not going to be too much to film today. So yeah, I'm going to go get my breakfast now and I'll get back to you later. In fact, I'll just show you Alice and Leo having their breakfast. Shall we show them your breakfast, Alice? Hey, what are you having for breakfast? <laughs> I'll just show you. So, Alice and Leo are having a treat for breakfast today. They're having pancakes and fruit. So, Leo's got pancakes and banana. Alice has got pancakes and orange, haven't you? But she's not sitting down to eat hers, are you? She was a minute ago. So, yeah, they're having that, and I'm going to go get some pancakes for me now. So, yeah, we'll get back to you later. Okay, so it's now half eleven. Alice and I are going to make some pizzas. Leo's taking his nap. So I'll probably do a quick time lapse of us doing this because we filmed it before, haven't we, Alice? But we might as well do a quick time lapse so you can see what we're doing. Okay, so these are the pizzas Alice and I have just made, so we're just about to put them in the oven for 10 minutes and then they'll be ready to eat. Yes. So our pizzas are all cooked now, so I'm just going to let them cool for a bit, then I'm going to cut them up and see if Alice wants a slice. Sometimes she'll eat a slice, sometimes she won't. But, um, if she doesn't, then I'll eat them both because I'm starving now. Leo is still taking his nap, so I think I'll do a bit of editing while I have my lunch and Alice has hers. Hi, so it is now half three. Leo is just taking his nap and I'm about to make a start on the dinner. So I'm making a roast today. So I'm just going to roast chicken, um, with roast potatoes, roast vegetables. And yeah, that's what we're going to do. I don't know if the kids will eat it because the last time we made it, they didn't eat it. I think they've gone off roast dinners, so I'm hoping they'll at least try it. 
anyway so i'm gonna make it so it's hopefully ready for when leo um for when lawrence gets home if i start it now half three should be ready by about half five and he should be home between half five six so i might have to leave his in the oven until he gets home for a bit but yeah i'm gonna start now i'll do a little time lapse of me doing it and yeah i'll get back to you probably when it's ready Hi, so it's now quarter past five. The chicken should be ready now and the vegetables and stuff. So I'm gonna get the chicken out, let it rest for a bit, uh, leave the vegetables in the oven um, to keep warm while I make the gravy and do the mashed potato and then the dinner should be ready around half past. So yeah, I'm just gonna do the gravy now because that'll take a while. Okay, so dinner is now ready. Lawrence is home, so it's all ready for us. Just need to put the gravy on, and then we can eat it. So yeah, I'm looking forward to eating this. Hi, so it's now it's about nine o'clock. What are you doing? Nah, time. <laughs> I think it's about nine o'clock. Kids are both in bed. Correction, twenty past nine. Twenty past nine. There you go. Kids are both in bed, so we're gonna watch some Netflix. What is yeah. it we're watching? Haunting of Blue Manor. Yeah, it's really good, isn't it? We're enjoying it so far. Yeah. And I'll do after the Hill House. So. Yeah, so we're going to watch that and then we're going to head to bed because he's in work early in the morning, aren't you? Yep, yeah. and nice might be an more exciting day. Top down our teeth today. Yeah, he, he took down the feet. <laughs> Alright then, so yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this week's weekly vlog. If you have, please give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye. Bye. <laughs>